I'm Frederick Mwiseneza. I come from Rwanda. I work in a government hospital as a laboratory scientist. Mark Embryologist program, Embryology program is very important for me because I run skills and knowledge. So about these skills will help our patient to get treatment which are, were not available in our country. Now in our country, we have many challenges. Our first challenges, we have no experts in fertility treatment. We have no embryologist. Even our people, they don't know about uh, fertility treatment. They have uh, different yeah, our people have ha, has different challenges. Uh, mostly for women, they are, they, there is some harassment for women. They most of illiterate people, they know they they know that woman is the one uh, who who get uh, fertility problem and that caused many challenges, caused many conflict between uh, uh, woman and men, even husband family, even different challenges about treatment. Uh, some of them they can't go for treatment because they they fear that they are there is the the one of the the problem, but uh, some of them, our people, they know that to approach hospitals, they can get diagnosis and even be cured. And uh, some with advanced mind, they know that one with the problem of fertility can be treated and cured. Yeah, those are different challenges. So we need many experts and many fertility experts in fertility treatment and in embryologists to try to explain for our people how this disease can be, is, can be cured. So other things I can add for that, if we have many experts, uh, some of our patients who travel in abroad countries for searching treatment. In the case we get uh, our clinic, those financial cost will be reduced. So reason why we need many support to have um, many experts with that fertility disease. So I can explain that for two, two ways. For illiterate people, they know that the woman is the one who get uh, fertility disease and for that there is a conflict between uh, husband and, uh, and men, even the family of uh, men. Uh, but for educated people, they, they know that fertility problem happen, just they, they give the woman advice and the cancer and to give counseling, then to inform that in the outside of our country there is a ERT treatment. Because our government uh, make the effort for that people who have the fertility problem, they try to, to inform or to cancer them that there is no need for divorce. Uh, they try to explain that as soon as possible, the center will come in our country. Those different issue of fertility will be reduced without divorce. The divorce in our country is not acceptable. It's to implement, and my plan is to implement 
the what I, I run here and, and to help our patient to get as soon as possible the treatment. The problem our country has is just personnel who work in that center. So I think after this training, our center will be started. We still want many support here because due to insufficient time compared with the package of training and this training is the first to, to have such skills. We want other refresher course on ERT to continue to improve. We have uh, done many things here. Uh, we know how do we can find the eggs from the fruits. We know how to to culture to culture them. We know how we do insemination. Uh, we know how how we grade different embryo until we transfer. We know how we can keep even our embryo. We know how we can keep where our sperm for a long time and then we know how we can remove from where we keep it how we tore we, we tore our 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 samples yeah we can we know how we can transfer those embryos to the patient and we know how to use micro manipulation when we have a few sperm for the theories, we run many things. We run on fertilization. We, we learn different, different aspects related on sperm. We, we learn how we can differentiate abnormal sperm and normal sperm. And we learn how we can differentiate, differentiate different, different oocyte, age oocyte, mature oocyte and uh, abnormal oocyte. I thank Mark Foundation so much to give, to give me these skills which are not available in our country. So by these skills we get from, our, from Mark Foundation, we help our country to start our centers and our patients who were lucky treatment will have those treatments on infertility. <laughs>